Just now we are really in front of the apartment of Ariel Sharon. In 1987, Sharon took this place. It's in the center of the Muslim quarter. From the other side, you see a huge flag with the big Hanukkah. He wanted to say to the Palestinians, I am the boss here. So, a lot of tension in this area. He wanted also this place. Because they wanted this place to be a hall for them, for the meetings. But the owner of the place refused. From that day, he had a lot of troubles with the taxes. You can't talk about normalization at the time you have occupiers and the nation under occupation. They look at themselves as superiors and they look on the Palestinians as inferiors. With such a mentality, you will never get peace. Once we are equal, we can talk about normalization. They talk a lot about city of peace. So never, whenever I walk and I see those soldiers with their submachine guns, I say, what kind of peace is this? In 1989, we were sitting with the other four young Palestinians. A settler came down on the bus, opened fire. This young Palestinian was killed on the place. He was 19 years old at that time. Newly married and the wife was pregnant. This is the father. What's really interesting about this case that up to date the Israeli claims that they couldn't find the settler who opened the fire. One day I had a delegation, American Jews. So one of the members of the delegation came and talked to the father. She said to him, do you hate Jews? He said, no, I don't hate Jews. I hate those who killed my son.